Now to a new warning about monkeypox and how it could spread among college students. A local doctor is warning not just students, but also universities saying they need to take precautions. And this comes as the state reaches the 1000 mark when it comes to cases. Channel 2's Candace McCowan joins us now live from the CDC in DeKalb County. And Candace, that doctor worried that students will make the number of cases here go even higher. Yeah, definitely room for concern. College kids, they are back at campus or headed that way, some of them close to each other in dorm rooms or either at parties. And that doctor is saying that there are precautions and steps that can be taken. Definitely makes me nervous. It's back to the classroom for Maral Grumrudy. The last two years, she had COVID precautions to work around. Now, starting her junior year, she's thinking about the latest health threat, monkeypox. Definitely be more cautious, um, not maybe go to areas where, you know, places where people are very close to each other, less parties, you know. Um, more secluded areas. We spoke with a Grady infectious disease specialist, Dr. Jonathan Colastani, who said it is smart to take precautions. First, he says every student should understand how monkeypox spreads through prolonged skin to skin contact or by coming in contact with soil sheets. He's warning students to take heed. What I would emphasize if you are sitting on other people's beds that you just don't know, um, that you would want to be fully clothed. If you're going to be at large parties and in very close quarters, again, having the skin covered can be very helpful. He's also warning universities to be prepared by having adequate testing and more. Also have processes whereby those students can easily identify themselves if they're concerned they may be at risk. Educational institutions need to be thinking about how they'll accommodate students that may need um, prolonged isolation for potentially weeks. For students, they're accustomed to health threats. Morale is ready to make sacrifices to be safe. Just want to get through it, uh, get my degree, but also enjoy college as much as I can. Understandable. Channel 2's Candace McCowan joins us now live again from the CDC. And Candace, you mentioned colleges starting back up again. I know you've been reaching out to many of them. Are they doing anything differently? Yeah, well, Wendy, that doctor says that the best thing that anyone can do in this situation, especially in those congregate settings, is if you experience any symptoms, is to seek medical care. I did reach out to several local universities to see what they were doing to deal with monkeypox cases. I heard from Emory. They're encouraging their students to seek medical attention as soon as they see any symptoms. But uh, we will keep pressing those other universities to see what they're going to do when those monkeypox cases arise. Wendy? All right, Candace McCown reporting live for us from the CDC. Thank you.